what is going on geeks unite the clans here back in yo life with some arc survival evolved and i'm coming at you from my own server and uh today we have got the center map set up and today we are going to be talking about where i should play where we should spend our time guys lately i have been focusing on building tutorials and i've had a lot of fun doing it um but i want to get back to let's playing to having fun goofing off playing with my friends and just uh you know having some casual relaxing arc survival evolved gaming fun and uh, i wanted to talk to you guys i wanted to see what you wanted to see um so this is my server and this is one of i think four places we could realistically spend a good amount of our time over the next little while. Um, the benefits of this server guys are I've got it set up in a way that lets me build and lets me build a lot. So wherever we go here I'd like to just pick a spot, one of the more beautiful spots uh, on the whole map, on, on any of the maps really and that's one of the benefits of this being mine and to build. Build up a cool area, villages and, and castles and things like that. Uh, the kind of projects that are far too big for a building tutorial, but incredibly fun and, and I don't know, really rewarding. So with that in mind, I, I wanted to wander around this place, guys. We're in the center redwoods right now, and uh, I'm coming at you from the back of an adorable, uh, a very adorable uh, terror bird. And uh, we're going to head up to an area where I've been doing some building. When we get up there, guys, we'll be able to have a look, see kind of what I have in mind for this place. But um, I'm currently active on three other servers. So after we get up to the city, I have been starting off up here. The, the little uh, the compound I've started building up on these redwood cliffs. Um, once we get up here, we'll have a look around, and then we're actually going to go jump to each of the other servers we might end up playing on. Oh, hey, what's up, T-Bone? How you doing, bud? Um, so you can see just how pretty it is up here, guys. I want to find the best-looking spots on every map and build something cool there. And we've been doing that lately with those building tutorials, but like I said, they're small, and I think we can do bigger and do better. Um, so I'm going to keep working my way up this mountainside. I'm trying to remember exactly how I get where I need to go. Yeah, this is it. Okay, let's keep going this way. Um, and I wanted to uh, to show you what I've been building, but the other servers we're going to look at, one is our Primitive Plus server. Now, I only ever made one episode from there, and um, I'd like to get back there. Um, Primitive Plus was a total conversion released recently, uh, not that recently, a little while back, that uh, allowed you to play a more primitive version of the game. It has a ton built into it, and a lot I'd really like to explore, but uh, the total conversion was so buggy when we first started that I, we didn't really get the chance to get into it. So even though that server is very quiet these days, I'd like to get back there and maybe start off a series that's a little more based on survival and a little more based on uh, exploring... You know what? I'm going to try something crazy. You guys ready for this? Based on exploring Primitive Plus and everything it has to offer... Here's my little, here's my little compound. Here's my little city. All right, can I get down here? Oh God, I'm gonna go off a cliff, aren't I? Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Whew, okay, perfect. So this is the spot. Have a look around. This is one of those spots I've been working on lately. I've been building up. And um, th this kind of building uh, on the servers I play on normally would take a really long time. But the way I've got it set up here, uh, with resource gathering and weight control, we could do a lot, and we could build a lot. Um, and I'd like to take a little compound like this and expand it out and go out into these areas uh, all around us here. I've got another compound here for parking dinos. And we have this amazing flat spot, and we're right on the edge of this waterfall that goes all the way down, crazy far down. And um, I want to pick spots like this and build up guys so if this is the kind of series you'd like to see it would be building and building every time we hop on no taming no other stuff it would just be a pure focus on building and um in cool spots cool spots like this let's see if i can do this ready yeah there you go check this out amazing yep we're gonna make it we're gonna make it okay perfect so guys with that in mind I think I've given you a decent idea of what to expect from playing on my server, the Building Evolved server. I want to get us ready, and we're going to jump over to one of the other servers. Let's head over to the Primitive Plus one. I was teasing, and we'll have a couple more spots to visit after that. And here we are, guys, back on the Primitive Unlimited server. 
I woke up under this staircase, and I think I think I logged off here maybe three months ago. I think we've got some some other people that haven't been here in a long time. I see bodies all over the place. There's my man Monkey Puzzle. So guys, I lament that this server never took off. Uh, I was really excited uh, for this place. Uh, I I we hopped on here in the the first day of Primitive Plus, and we did it with um, Monkey Puzzle, who's down there, uh, with BLP Aaron B. With, um, uh, I can't remember who else was around, Alexis Arcade, uh, G.I. Jane, a bunch of cool people, Whitman, Arali, and we had so much trouble with, um, with Primitive Plus that we took some time off, and nobody's really been back in a while, guys, but this is an incredibly cool total conversion, other than the incredibly long load times. Man, I've never seen any of this stuff in person. I've seen a bunch of it in people's videos, but... This is a cool spot. So the only person who stuck around here a long time and played was Whitman, uh, and I suppose uh, Monkey Puzzle did uh, as well too. I think he built this building. Um, yeah, a lot has happened here, um, but I'm I, I haven't been here in a long time, guys. So uh, if we were to hop back on, it it probably wouldn't have as much to do with this place. This place is partially built and and built up a little bit with some of these cool primitive plus building materials that you're seeing up here now. That's the lumber walls and the, the brick window frames and um, we're standing on adobe uh, foundations right now. Not uh, not like the scorched earth adobe foundations, different ones. So this is our spot and this is where we built up. But I think, guys, if we were to set off to go to go do something on this server, to make something out of this this uh, server, we would we might leave. We might head off into the wilderness of the center and start fresh, maybe on one of those little boats. And um, I think the the real excitement here, guys, is in all the cool technology. How different this is than Vanilla Arc. So let's go ahead and have a look at some of our engrams here, and you'll see. Let me see. Uh, is there a way to, to filter the primitive plus ones in? It doesn't look like it. Okay, I'll scroll down. All right, guys, so here's where you see it coming in. We've got um, a battle axe, uh, brick building pieces, concrete building pieces, fish bait, uh, lumber glass. We've got benches, uh, lumber building pieces, this obsidian pick, which is what I have in my hand right now. You can see obsidian arrows, uh, new pistols, hammers, uh, new rifles. This apiary is for raising bees. There are hundreds of cool engrams. And and this, this total conversion for me, it feels like it's made for homesteading, for heading off, building up a little base, and surviving, and farming crops, and, and, and doing cool things. And I, I, think, I think if we were to play here, guys, that is what we would do. It's been so long since I've been here, and I I don't know. It feels like this server isn't going anywhere, but I know it's been quiet lately. Um, but I, I do want to come here. I do want to play, and I, I want to make the most of Primitive Plus because the launch wasn't great, and we had a lot of bugs and a lot of glitches, and it scared a lot of people off, but I do think it's one of the coolest total conversions out there, and it's one I'm dying to explore. So, guys, I am going to jump over to another one of our servers. Why don't we head back? to the Iron Mine server, another place I haven't been in a very long time. We'll have a look around, we'll talk about what a series there might look like, and then we'll make our final stop back on the Molten Iron server, my Scorched Earth server. So let me know what you think, guys. You're not going to have to decide today. I'm probably going to play a little bit at each of these spots, and I'll see what you guys like the most, what gets the most views, comments, likes. But um, for now, we're going to step away from this Primitive Plus server, and I hope to be back in the very near future. Ooh, it is weird to be back here as well guys we're back we're back on the iron mine server and i haven't been here in so dang long this is my spot on craig's island and i've actually never seen it with the fall foliage uh, i started up with the crew on the iron mine server i guess less than a year ago and um i sort of fell back in love with arc i had been playing on a small server with uh, low rates and uh, my one recording partner had quit on me, and I was looking for people to play with, real YouTubers, and I found these guys. Uh, I'm not sure who's active on the server now, but I've made, I think, 50 videos from here, and um, it's not the same as it used to be, I have to admit, guys. Uh, my pal McMastodon, not really playing around here anymore. Same with SW Chris. 
I can't believe everything's still alive and doing well. It has been a long, long time. So this is our spot on Crags Island, and I'm not sure what we would do if we, we came back here. Um, I mean, we could head off to a new place, a new biome, and start fresh, sort of a season two for us on Iron Mine. Or we could stay here, and we could keep expanding. I mean, I, I think I left... The last time I was here was shortly before Scorched Earth came out. I was having fun and and hitting a bit of a wall because of titanosaurs. That, by the way, is a statue of a titanosaur. They kept popping up on my island and flattening all my favorite trees. And I was getting so grumpy. I'm not really proud of what I've built here, guys. For 50 episodes, I really don't have much. So if we were to build here, I'd... I don't know what I'd want to do. Um... We'd really have to do some, we'd have to do some exploring and figuring out, but I, I like this server and, and this place enough to just hop on here every few days and play and explore and record and bring you guys along for the ride. New people have joined since I was on last. My man Arali the Geek lives just over there. It's not quite rendering in. And um, uh, I think if I were to wander back to this server and start playing with some regularity, I could convince some of my YouTuber pals to come back here and play with me. We have had so many good times here over uh, over the last year, guys. Uh, and if you haven't seen any of this stuff, if you haven't seen OUTC in this recognizable solid gold armor, you got a lot of videos you missed out on. So wander back, check out the playlist. I'm sure I'll put it in the cards and in the description. And you can catch up on what's happened here on the Iron Mine server. Um, this is a place where we're already set up, where we could move into more of the end game stuff and really, yeah, really get set up. Um, so this is my place, remarkably, almost all my stuff's still alive. I'm not sure where my Quetzals are, but, um, yeah. All right, guys. So I think I've shown you enough to give you an idea of what this Iron Mind server is all about. And it, it, like I said, it's been the longest time since I've been back here. So, uh, I would be excited to get back and to get to know this place again like I once did very well. Um, but that does it for the Iron Mine server, guys. Now we are going to hop back onto Molten Iron, the Scorched Earth version, the sister server to this one, the Scorched Earth version. And um, that is the place I've played most recently. And we'll go check out where we're at and what we do if we headed back to that server. Welcome back, guys. Welcome back to the Molten Iron server and to Scorched Earth. This is the place we played most recently. It really hasn't been that long since I was on here all the frickin' time. And this is the most active of all the servers. We just toured around. Uh, I know for sure there are at least four or five guys playing on here and playing all the time. And this is our place. Uh, in the last few episodes on this server, we built this, this villa. Uh, I had Arali come over. We painted the place up in cantaloupe and cyan. I've since decked out my dino pen in cantaloupe and cyan. I've got a bunch of my dinos with matching saddles. So I actually need to get myself out of this white cowboy outfit and try and match in with the rest of this crew. I think those those colored saddles look great. But um, this, this place, guys, it's active and... Scorched Earth is still new. There's a lot to explore. There's caves we haven't conquered. There are things we haven't tamed. Death worms and mantises. There's a lot we could do on this place, and I would like to get to that, let alone wyverns and whatnot. So, um... So, guys, I... I know for sure I'm going to be coming back and playing here on the Molten Iron server. This is a spot I... I'm coming back whether you guys want me to or not. And we're going to play, and we're really going to get back into the fun part of Ark Survival Evolved. I love building, and I really wanted to get some of those building tutorials bouncing around my brain out and onto video so you guys can build them in your worlds. And we will definitely be keeping those up. But I want to get back to the fun. Most of everything I've done in Ark has been like this, on a server, in survival, playing for fun. And... um I want to get back. So this is one spot I will be at, and you guys don't have to make up your minds now. Over the next uh, couple of weeks, I will spend some time at each of the four servers we toured around today, and um, and you guys can let me know. You can let me know with your comments, with your likes, with your views and your shares, what you want to see more of, and whatever does the best, that's what you guys will see more of. Um, I also have plans in the very near future to get to play with you guys. Thank you so much for all your support along the way. I want to find a way for us to play together, for you to be in my world and me to be in yours. So stay tuned till the new year, and um, there will be a way to do that as well. And once we get there, guys, I will probably have 
my series be set on the server with all y'all. So, um, yeah, that does it for this one, guys. Um, I, I, I hope I've shown you enough of each of the four servers, and if I haven't, get ready, because I'll have videos coming. Uh, I think it'll be episode two of Primitive Plus, episode 46 or something of Iron Mine, um, episode, what, 12 of this, and... Yeah, it would be episode one on my server uh, if we decide to play there. So uh, expect videos from all those places over the next little while, guys. And, and thank you for taking the time to hang out with me as I tour around all my servers. If you particularly like one and you want to see a video from there, let me know and I'll make sure I do that first. Uh, but until then, guys, my name is Unite the Clans. Thank you so much for checking this out. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.